guys, welcome back to my channel, Study Ram with Vasu. So what we are we gonna learn today? We are gonna learn the multiplication and division of integers. You might be thinking it's a very hard topic. We cannot do it, but indeed it's actually a very easy topic. So let's get started. How to multiply the integers? We can multiply the integers with the help of some given rules for sets. Like for multiplying two positive integers, we have a rule that the product is always positive when we multiply two positive integers. For example, here. This is 4 into 3, which is equal to 12. So, here 4 and 3 are positive. So, 12 is also positive. Here, 10 into 12 equal to 120. Here, these two are positive. These and this. So, the result is also positive. Next rule. Multi if you want to multiply two negative integers, then the rule is the product is always again positive. Like in this example, minus 4 into minus 3 equals to 12. Here, because both of them are negative integers, the answer is positive integer. Next, minus 6 into minus 7. In this example, minus 6 and minus 7 both are negative integers. And thus the product is always positive and it is positive. Next, how to multiply a positive integer by a negative integer? That is a big question. Okay, so the rule is the product of a positive integer and a negative integer is always negative. Or like you can see in this example, 4 into minus 3 equal to minus 12. That by, uh, we have to multiply the absolute values and add the minus sign. Same in this example, 8 into minus 2 is equal to minus 16. Then, this is the fourth rule. Multiplying or how to multiply and get the answer by negative integer by a positive integer. The product of a negative integer and a positive integer is always negative. Minus 4 into 3 equal to minus 12. And minus 5 into 6 equal to minus 30. I hope you have understood this concept very clearly. And now let's learn the key takeaways. Two positive integers when we multiply equals to a positive result. Like 4 into 3 equal to 12. And two negative integers when we multiply is we also equal to a positive result 4 into 3 minus 3 equal to 12 one positive one negative integer when we multiply it results to a negative result like here in this example 4 into minus 3 equal to minus 12 now there are some tips that you can use for remembering if there are same signs of integer, we use the product is of course positive. And if the signs of the integer are different, the product is negative. Now we are gonna learn the division of integers. So, how to divide the integers? The rules in multiplication are common in division also. Like, if you divide a positive integer with a 
positive integer the answer is a positive int the quotient or the answer is a positive integer while if you divide a negative integer with a negative integer the answer is a positive integer if there are different signs of integers like minus 3 divided by minus 1 no my uh, minus minus 3 divided by 1 it equals to a negative integer or 1 divided by minus 3 also equals to a negative integer examples 12 divided by 3 equals to 4 positive divided by positive equal to positive minus 12 divided by minus 3 equal to plus 4 negative divided by negative integer equals to a positive integer then 12 divided by minus 3 equal to minus 4 so here positive integer divided by negative integer is equal to a negative number and here minus 12 divided by 3 equals to minus 4 negative integer divided by a positive integer equals to a negative integer hope you understood the concept well and i hope that you do not have any trouble finding it hard for dividing and multiplying integers if you did not check out my video on how to subtract and add integers and the introduction to integer go and check it out cause they are also in the same group and links are given in the description box below do like and subscribe to my channel if you like my videos and do not forget to share it with your friends so they also get to know about my channel bye guys See you next time with a new video.